This is how you operate a calculator. First off, I'll turn it off. Okay, now how to explain how to turn it on. There's a button right here. You grab your finger. This is my finger. And this is my middle finger. Eh, bad finger, bad. Okay, this is my finger. And now, here's the on switch. Now, if this is only for that Texas instrument calculator, so it won't work on other calculators. Because they might not have that button. So, anyways, here's the on-off button. We're going to press that to turn it on. Now it's on. Yay! And if you want to punch in a problem, just pick a number, random number, like 6 or 9. Then you can add, choose anything, add, multiply, times, divide. We'll try plus. We'll add 6. And you'll get the prob answer right there. That's basically how you operate a calculator, except you can use anything. Just make sure you, and now, just make sure you, uh, um, kind of, make sure you know uh, what buttons mean what. So, anyways, this is how you turn it off. There's a second degree, as you can see, and there's also, right above there, there's an off, this is an on-off thing. However, if I just press that, nothing happens, see? However, if I press this, and this, it goes off. The, that's because the green letters it says off, and so I just put in second version. Anyways, that's basically I who operate a Texas instrument calculator. Happy um, calculating, I guess.